break-ins at a local cemetery forcing police to take action. It happened again at Holy Sepulchre on Lake Avenue. We've reported on this before. Now we're hearing about more issues. Atia Collins joining us now live. Atia, as I just mentioned, not the first break-in at that cemetery. What are the plans to increase security there? Well, that's exactly right, Adam. Police say they're going to increase patrols here, and cemetery leaders say they're focusing their cameras on some gathering spots. Both have some suggestions for visitors to keep themselves space safe when coming to the cemetery. Jamie Mack is pleading with the community for help after items were stolen from her car while she was visiting her mother's mausoleum here at Holy Sepulchre Cemetery. Very disgusting that you do something like that at a cemetery. Mack lost her purse, her work bag, and a phone with voicemails from her mother who had passed away. She says her car was unlocked, but she wasn't gone long. My mom always did tell me to lock my doors, and um, I should have listened. Just the one time that I get forget. Mac reported the stolen items to police, who were already looking into four larcenies at the same cemetery last week. In a statement today, police said they have increased patrol in the area as well as in the cemetery itself and recommends for all people to lock their car doors and remove any belongings from view. Staff from Holy Sepulchre are working with police to plan a response. You know, we have security patrols throughout the, uh, throughout the premises. Uh, we have security cameras. And we work closely with RPD. There's basic safety practices that people can can work on just to ensure that they're they're safe here. For Mac, she is hoping for the safe return of the phone. I don't care about the money, like it's replaceable. But the phone that has my mom's voice on it since she's passed, that's something that I can't replace. It's something that is very meaningful to me. Mac is just hoping that whoever did this will hopefully return her phone anonymously here to Holy Sepulchre Cemetery. Reporting in Rochester, Atia Collins, News 8. All right, Atia, thank you. And police are telling us they're still investigating all of these thefts. And you can help them if you have any information. Just call 911.